A man fell from a campaign vehicle that was, and was immediately crushed to death, adding a grisly twist to chaotic campaigns in Kibra, where several people were injured during a Jubilee campaign foray on Saturday. Well, now ODM and Jubilee parties are trading accusations over the Saturday violence with Jubilee MPs asking for disqualification of ODM's Imran Okoth for allegedly breaching election laws. Mm. Stephen Little has more. With barely three weeks left before Kibra decides in a by-election, <laughs> the ongoing campaigns have turned ugly. Only yesterday, Jubilee Party candidate McDonald Moriga's campaign car was vandalized. This morning, a group of youth attempted to storm into the PCA church in Kibra, hurling stones where Jubilee lawmakers were attending a church service. We Leo tulipoingia hapa tumesikia pia wao vijana wametufuata hapa nje. Sababu jana tulipigwa na wana ODM walitupiga na mawe na sasa hii watoto wakiwa hapa nikasema au au watu walikuwa wanapiga watu mawe wangekulia kwa kanisa au wangefanya jambo kama hiyo. Jubilee lawmakers saying they will write to the IEBC demanding disqualification of the ODM candidate from the race for flaunting election rules. Watu wa Kibra ni watu wa amani. Kwa hivyo Simba Arati aache ku waache tumbo joto sababu ya huyu Mariga. ODM MPs were quick to dismiss the claims of violence. Jana tulisikia ile team nyingine walijiorganize wakavunja gari yao wakajipiga. Si ni kweli? Alafu wakaenda police station ku report at ni watu wa ODM ndio waliwapiga. Si ni hivyo? Mnasema eti mimi niliambia vijana wapige gari. Hatutaki fujo. Lakini kama unataka fujo sisi tuko. Kuchokozwa kama vile nimeona jana hapa. Watu wanachoma gari yao wenyewe na wanasema ODM ndio wanafanya. Sasa wajitiarishe kwa vita yenyewe. ANC leader Musalia Mudabadi leading campaigns in Laini Saba grounds condemning the violence in Kibra over the ongoing by election. Na kwa ruto ajue hiyo ni nyumba ya serikali. Imejengwa. Muchana hapa mnauziwa vya maingine ati Owalo, ati Mariga, lakini kivika usiku. Owalo, Mariga wanaenda kare. Police this evening confirmed the death of one man who was ran over by a campaign cars near Yaya Center. The man was reportedly hanging on another campaign vehicle from which he fell before being ran over by another. With the November 7th death for the Kibra by-election fast approaching, the political tensions in Kibra have hit their record high with rival political parties crisscrossing the constituency to hunt for votes. Stephen Leto, Citizen TV. Kibra constituency, Nairobi County.